You can study in the morning, you can study at night. You can study outside by a campfire light. You can study with the rabbit. Do you remember waiting by the mailbox for the mail to arrive? And then, depending on whether it was a small envelope or a big envelope, stressing out about whether you got into college and what that size envelope might be telling you. Do you remember how stressful it was to open that envelope? I do. I remember getting rejected from Washington University and waitlisted at Brandeis University. I remember the acceptances that I was excited about and the acceptances that, well, they were just fallback schools anyway, so I expected that. I remember all the stress of that choice. Where am I going to go to college? If there was one thing that I could do, it would be to want to tell my younger self, relax, don't worry about it. Where you go to college does not determine your course in life. It impacts it. It makes a difference. But it is not the be-all and end-all. It turns out, I kind of do get to tell my younger self that. Except it's not my younger self, it's my daughter's younger self. This past weekend, we visited a couple of colleges, both of which she got accepted to, one of which she wasn't, didn't get accepted in the way that she wanted, but she was accepted nonetheless. And she is so stressed out. And I get it. I understand. She doesn't really listen to me anymore. But if she did, the one thing I would tell her is, don't worry. Whatever choice you make, you're going to determine your own experience. You're going to craft the classes and the experiences and the circles of friends and, and the, the extracurricular activities. You're going to create that. You're going to craft the experience for yourself. And it doesn't matter if you go to this college or that college, this university or that university. I get how stressful it is to make these decisions. But with just a little bit of hindsight under my belt, I wish I could tell her and all the other kids that right now are stressing about college, it's okay. Whatever school you decide to go to, the responsibility to create the experience that you want is not in the school's hands. It's in yours. Choose the right classes. Choose the right teachers. Choose the right friends. Choose the right extracurricular activities. Choose Hillel or Chabad or sororities or, or sports. Whatever it is that you're looking for, I almost guarantee you, you can find it anywhere because the experience is yours to create. If I could tell her anything, if I could tell me 25 years ago anything, that's what it would be. We're talking Torah. Talking Torah.